Okay, everyone. Welcome to Dark Souls 2. I've been playing this a lot in my free time. I said, why not record it for YouTube? Because you know what they say. If you're good at something, never do it for free. That is completely irrelevant. Blah, 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 irrelevant. Because... No one's good at Dark Souls. I've already pretended to read all this before. So it's just... Get through it all. Blah, 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 blah. Accept. So... Uh... Just... As a warning... While playing this... I will be... Screaming a lot. I'll be probably cursing a lot. So if you're not allowed to hear that, just like don't watch my video or just put headphones on. And so, perhaps you've seen it. Oh, oh, is this the cutscene? Dream a murky, forgotten land. I'll be quiet then. A place where souls may mend your ailing mind. Okay, I do have I just have to state this out. I love the graphics in this cutscene. Even though it's like the only like actual film cutscene, like a full-fledged cutscene in the game that I know of. Please correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but I'm pretty sure this is, but I just have to say, it looks amazing. An augur of darkness. Your past, your future, your very light. That chick's got milk. None will have meaning, and you won't even this care. This bad joke, hell yeah. Then you'll be something other than human. A thing that feeds on souls, a hollow. Long ago, in a walled off land far to the north, a great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? But one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without really knowing why. Okay, I just have to state once again, this, this scene is just so beautiful. For that, 
is your fate. The fate of the cursed. Down we go. And that's the end of that. So anyway, I usually play Sorcerer. So to mix things up a little bit, I decided that I'll play a different type of class. And with that being said, me playing a different class, I won't know exactly what to level up and stuff. I do know stamina is always a good thing to level up. Okay. So, let's just... Man, I'm not used to my health bar being so tiny. So run past here, because if, if you stay here, there's going to be these weird animals that try to screw you over. It's not fun. Now how would we fit? I wonder what it is. Oh wait. Was I about to dry the try something stupid or what? A small, smooth, and silky stone. Fun fact, we can give the small stones to the two, two tiny birds. Can't remember the name, but then they give you stuff. I've just noticed I've never really traveled to the things betwixt. I've always just ran straight into the witch hut. I'll be quiet again, there's another cutscene. <laughs> what seems to be the ruckus? Oh my, your face. The face of the curse. It's an undead. An undead has come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All the ones like you. You spoke to that kind old dear, didn't you? <laughs> You're finished. You'll go hollow. Yes, you'll become one of them. Hollows prey upon men, feast upon their souls. This is the fate of the cursed. <laughs> what is your name? My name is Alphonse. Because that's what I like to be called. Although, as most of you know, not Alphos, as most of you know, my real name is David. I just like the name Alphonse, it sounds cooler. Like, way cooler. Oh, Alphonse. Are you sure of your name? Nah, I'm, I'm not sure my name is that. Pfft. No idea. human effigy. Take a closer look. Who do you think it's supposed to be? 
think back deep into your past. Yes, it's an effigy of you. Okay, class. Let's see. Battle Scarred Warrior, High Strength, Dexterity, Skilled with Weapons. Find a skilled swordsman, fights gracefully with strong weapons in both hands. Sounds like my kind of play style, if not sorcerer. Because I, I always just love playing sorcerer due to the fact that you just kill your enemies with the infinite ammo. Of course, it's not infinite, but at least you don't need to go like buy more. You can just rest that bonfire. Oh wow, that's one nice cake. Just saying. Um, bandit. Ah, it's deprived. Wow, that's horrible. I would never pick that. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Swordsman. Swordsman's my kind of dude. My gift, I always go with Life Ring. Just because of that tiny bit of health that can help you so, so much. I have no idea what the seed of, of the Tree of Giants does. So yeah, I'm going to take the Life Ring. I'm good to my body, doesn't matter, really, none of this stuff matters, so I'm just gonna start. Yes. I am a swordsman, I swear. I practiced by stabbing scarecrows in my grandpa's farm. To break the curse. You're no different, I should think. Doesn't stand a chance. Well, you never know. <laughs> Go through the door and trot along to the kingdom. But remember, hold on to your souls. They're all that keep you from going hollow. Oh, I'll fool you no longer. You lose your souls. All of them. Over and over again. <laughs> Okay, so I have a question. How did these stones keep their whole tree home stop from firing? Like, burning down. I don't know why firing came out. Yeah, but like, those stones shouldn't be able to keep that whole fire from burning down the tree fort. Although, how cool would the tree fort is it, really? It's awesome. It's better than anything your cat, your, bleh, your dad could have built. Unless your dad was like really big on hollowing out giant trees that just grew in your backyard. And however unlikely that that is, good on you if it did happen. I bet you're real proud. And finally, bro. Now, if you're not familiar, these bonfires. 
they are like save points. So I'm just going to run through the intro and get to the place. I can't seem to remember the end of it. I just want to hit that guy. What a go, bro. Nope, didn't want to hit him. Die. I have my dagger and my scabbard. Together I will destroy all the enemies that cross my path. All of them. No exceptions. Oh, 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 oh. I did not see you. Oh, we're breaking out into song. Okay, well. Just a, uh, just a tip. Don't fight those. Do not fight the hippo-looking dudes. They will wreck your shit. You will not live if you fight them first off, like, just starting out in the game. It's, like, impossible. Probably not, but highly unlikely. What you gonna do about it? I murdered your friend. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Oh, he's coming at me. He's coming at me. Dead. Now, 190 souls might seem like a lot, but it's not. are a lot easier as a swordsman than a sorcerer, I just gotta say. Uh, I forgot. 17 minutes in. I know this is a bit late, but how was your day? <laughs> I'm terribly sorry. But, uh, how was your day? You, you, give us more. If it was good, then that's great. Give us Suki! What this be? Yes. I give them their small, smooth, and silky stone. They give me a bleed stone. You, you, give us smooth. I don't have any more. Yes, you give us silky. It's a bleed stone. That's not bleed stone. That's not bleed stone. And now this is a bleed stone. You guys seem to be bleed stones. What does a bleed stone even do? Yo, yo, give it move. I'm terribly confused. They gave me a bleed stone. And I have no idea what it does. And I can't find it in my inventory to see. So I'm just gonna move on. And I realize that this is taking too long. So I'm just run through all the way to uh Magchlet. Magchlet? Something like that. Man, look at all these messages. What does this say? Boulder ahead. Enemy ahead. 
rock laggard weakness. What enemy? All those messages and it's Majula. All those messages didn't make any sense. Nope, there's an item over here. It's a divine blessing. Those are actually pretty good. Uh, I can see the blacksmith sitting alone outside of his shed, full of his tools that he will need. And I've only played through some of Dark Souls twice. Like, I got past. I can't remember what it's called. The really dark place with all the weird zombie Are looking you? stuff. Or merely a pawn of fate. Bearer of the curse. I will remain by your side till this frail hope shatters. I like this chick's hair. Take this with you. May it ease your journey. Yes, an Estes flask. Thank you. See. He who made Dranglake what it once was. King Vendrick. King Vendrick. Bearer of the curse. Seek mis- For misery will lead you to gr- You will never meet the king with a soul. Okay, so... I already lit this, right? Okay. It's lit. This bonfire is lit. I have no idea how many other people have made that joke. So to my knowledge, there's a couple items around town that you can easily get. Just by booking, you know. So that one, just one over by the blacksmith. And then there's one in the well. Got me boxes. I was having trouble in a box. Well, that will show how well we're going to do in this game if I have trouble hitting one box. Imagine how much trouble I'm going to have hitting people. Now, this one I actually didn't know until my stepbrother showed me. I'll have to pick up the item. And so now, I will have two Estes flasks. Which will help me on my journey. Ah, ah, ah. I gotta talk to this gym. The Emerald Herald. British. What's her name? Seek those whose names, Seek those are, whose names are unutterable. The four endowed with immense souls. Their souls, their souls, their souls will serve souls. as a beacon. Once you, Once you have found them, them turn dear to, to, to me. So that hope, so hope will not fade away. away. Is that a shard? You yes, yes, it is. It is. Light. I, I However, I want to upgrade. Yes. Bam. Yes. Thank you. Now, I'm gonna go to my favorite spot for my favorite. Ah. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. I've hoped you enjoyed, and if you did, leave a like, and subscribe if you're interested in seeing more. And with that, I thank you for watching.